This is what your Windows desktop will look like after the end of this video. A clean, modern and fully customized look completely transformed the default Windows 11 style in just a few simple steps. I'll show you exactly how to install this custom theme safely, easily. You can make your desktop look amazing too. Ready to level up your Windows experience. Let's get started. Hey everyone, in today's video, I'll show you how to install a custom theme on your Windows 11 desktop step by step, completely transform your Windows feel and look. Let's get started. First thing, we have to create a restore point before we making any system changes. It is highly recommend to create a restore point. Go to the start menu and search for create and then here you can see the create restore point. Just click on it and then just select your C drive and then click on create and give it a name and then click on create so it will create a restore point in case anything goes wrong you can revert your system using restore point and then click on close and then ok ok so next thing you have to do head over to this website and scroll down here you can see this latest release just click on here and then scroll down and you need to download this theme tool here you can see the secure UX theme just click on it so it will download a theme tool just install this theme tool and then click on yes and then it will require a reboot just click on yes to reboot your system okay after that head over to this website and then download this theme tool just click on it it will download the theme tool and then copy to desktop okay now just unzip this theme tool and then open this theme tool just right click on it and then click on run as administrator and then click on yes ok after that you will see a interface like that so now I'll show you step by step how to install a custom theme ok here you can see the custom theme just go to this theme folder and copy this theme files and then go to this PC and then go to local disk C and then go to windows and then go to resources and then go to themes and paste it here and then open this theme tool again right click on theme tool and click on run as administrator and then click on yes in here you can see the mac os bloom dark theme uh, you can choose whatever theme you want you can choose any any of theme just click on apply so it will apply the theme so here you can see the theme has been applied just close it and theme has been applied now we need to install the icon pack to install this icon pack we need a tools called 7dsp here you can see i already downloaded it all links are given in the description box or on my debian art profile just check it out and then unzip this file and then click on ok and now go to this file and we need to rename it ok now we need to go to this mac os bloom icon pack and just rename it also just remove this remove text and now go to this 70sp folder and here you can see the 70sp tool just right click on it and then click on run it as administrator then click on yes and then click add custom pack and then go to this mac os bloom folder again here you can see the 70 sp theme icon pack just select that icon pack and then click on start patching and then click on yes so it will take some time to complete the process until that wait i'll be right back after complete this icon pack installation <coughs> okay so icon pack installation has been complete just click on yes to reboot your computer okay so icon pack has been applied here you can see the new icons everything has been changed new icon has been applied new folders everything has changed now now we need to modify our windows 11 explorer to modify our windows 11 explorer you can use any of them you can use start all back or you can use windhog setup so uh, let me show you start all back how to use it just double click on it and then click on install for me
and then right click on taskbar and then click on properties and then close this taskbar and then click on restart now and then go to this start menu and turn off also and then go to explorer and then click on windows 7 command bar and close it okay so explorer has been modified now or you can use window also i'll show you next time how to modify your explorer with window and uh, now we need to install some acrylic effect to use acrylic effect we need a tool called plarmica just head over to this website and here you can see this release page just click on it and scroll down and then download this release folder and then just extract this file and then click on ok and then just cut this folder to your C drive and then open it go to release folder and now we need to make some changes here this config file just double click to open it and here you can see the show lines and just make it true to false and then just click on file and then save and then here you can see the register file just right click on it and then click on run as administrator and then click on yes and then click on ok so it will add acrylic effect on your windows 11 explorer and that's it you have successfully installed a custom theme on windows 11 if you found this tutorial helpful give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more desktop customization tips see you next time till then stay tuned